Hello world, I'm Conrad from Round. We're playing Dawn of War Unification mod. Uh, we're doing something a little special today. 7.0 is on the horizon. And so, actually, I'm going to grab. We'll do it this. Uh, one of the things that's happening is that this game mode is actually being eliminated. This is Kill Team. Alright, Fleet of Foot, Haywire Bombs, Plasma Grenades. All right, so this is the hero from Last Stand. All right, so can I just attack? Is that going to work? Like, I could probably win this, but hey. Um, the, the game mode is a little weird. Uh... And like a buggy, I think is why it's being removed. And they've been working on things like Last Stand, which is they consider to be a better version. But before it went, I kind of wanted to uh, say goodbye, in a way. Oh, you can decap. Nice. All right. So where are you? Hmm. Alright. Oh, I can activate Fleet Foot, can I? I'm not sure how they're capping so quickly. Oh. Oh, it, uh. That goes very quickly, that's why. Alright. This is kind of funny. I just, I wanted to play this before it, uh. It went away. And we are. Alright, so the question is can I use anything? Our resources, I know they can probably like reinforce. All right, also, they do not provide a uh, direct bonus. What they do is, uh, all right, let's grab this for the uh, what you call it, the view, so that we can see. We can maybe catch them. Alright, I should be able to outrun them with Slate of Foot. And so I can start shooting them a bit. Maybe? Alright, now I can just pursue. All right, now they're chasing me. Okay, honestly, can I just win this fight? No, okay. Why aren't they decapping? Oh, there they go. Just shoot them. How much damage this is doing? Very insignificant. Alright. Kinda wanna get in another plasma grenade. Alright, get close, throw a grenade, and then we're gonna fight this. Because they're just gonna be able to spend Close in, start stabbing, and there, there we go. 
We should win this because we're like high level and whatever. We've got stats. Let's actually just go to. What is their health? They're at like two thirds? Come on. Get the stab. We're gonna get another grenade, aren't we? At this rate? And they're just kinda running around. This is true, us Eldar are superior. Also, I did realize at the start that we did, for I did forget, in fact, forget to change my color scheme from Luthway to my custom Bayond color scheme, but it's fine. All right, they're gonna decap this, which is fine. I get to uh, get the stabs in. This almost feels unfair. Yeah, they do not like that at all. Which really sucks for them, doesn't it? All right, they're at 10,000. It's so like a third, so yeah, I easily win this. All right, I think we're going to run another one of these. Uh, we're just going to set it as uh, like an actual squad instead of... Uh, what was you call this? You are getting shots in as you chase. They're going to have low accuracy because we are fleet of foot, but... Why don't you stab that guy because he's almost dead. This might be the final set of blows. They've not reinforced, so I think they might be out of resources. I believe you could take on an Autarch. Do you have any idea how long she spent training in a way of war? That's one down. Here you go, two more. Oh. No, they're still here. Point blank grenade. You can't run. You can't run from the Eldar. Alright. What other points have they claimed, by the way? Doesn't look like any. Huh. Weird. Alright, yeah, we're gonna run another one I wanna play as like the Seer Council or something. Just real quick. Uh, doesn't crash at least. <laughs> kind of fun. I can see why it is similar to Last Stand, but it's it's comp it's almost competitive Last Stand. So, but yeah, it's kind of fun. I'm glad I got a game or two in before it does in fact get removed in 7.0, which we are expecting to drop incredibly soon. Another one. Notably, because we're playing as a squad, I think we're going to need to uh, cap points early so that we can reinforce our squad. I'm going to go with, I think, yeah, the CR Council is going to be a good choice because they're tanky. Um, they all have good damage, but they're also fast. Um, question is, does it, do they come with all the upgrades? So, like, will they be able to entangle and whatnot? I do hope so, but I'm not sure. I'm not sure. I've, I think I've played the Seer Council in uh, Last Stand like once, but I don't really remember it. <laughs> so I don't remember if they get to entangle or not. Uh, it would be convenient. All right, Blood River. Here we go. All right, let's grab our Seer Council. Maybe we could have grabbed Warp Spiders or Reapers, but we cannot entangle. If squad members or 
Warlock, is there a difference? Alright. We cap. Oh, but we don't start with Fleet of Foot either. Okay, that's kind of annoying. Actually, go here, and then here, and then here. And then we're going to cap the center again. Alright, what do you need? 75, 125. Okay, maybe the Warlock has it. Or something like that. It's weird that there's two sets, though. Squad members. Oh, wait. I had it shift clicked, but not anymore. Alright. 125, 50, 75, 50. Hmm. So. So, yeah, I could grab this, but I kind of want to wait for this. All right, now we're gonna grab that and then we'll probably grab this and like their points or something. Um, okay, they just captured that. There they are, they went salt, salt marines again. All right, grab this. They're running away. That's fine. That's fine. If I get another point, I'll be able to grab a member. And so we'll be able to have some of both. All right, but let's see what this unlocks. Hmm. Okay, so it adds this, but we can't use it. That is weird. The relic is taking a bit of time to cap. Do you cap? Hmm. So is it Seer Council or Warlock? Seer Council. Oh. So you grab both. Nice. So that provides an extra big resource boost. I did not realize that. They're over there. We can see their cover bonus. Are they capping that or what? No. There they are. We got We're going after that point for some reason. Yeah, it's fine. They, they don't actively generate uh, our resources, so we honestly. There's not particular reason to hold them. That means we could recapture them later and get the bonus. It didn't... That one didn't give us a bonus. Oh, does they only give a bonus once? Okay, that might be kind of annoying. Yeah, it's probably fair, but... Ma'am? Or maybe there's a cap? Well, that one gave us a bonus. Weird. All right, we're going to grab that. They're taking the relic. Eh, fine. If I could out-reinforce them, I'm happy with that. All right, grab this point. Actually, no, we're going to intercept them here and the now. We should win this because we're higher tier units. Actually, we can just shoot them to get some hits in. Okay, maybe do we lose uh, when... when uh, how are we doing? We've lost like 100 health. They've lost a lot of health. Yeah, we're we're busting them open. Oh, this is a freaking slaughter. <laughs> uh, okay, I want, I want another. I want another. This is fun. All right. I want to do it with a ranged squad this time. 
Um, I do hope we can flay foot though. You know, the Autarch we had flay foot. Excuse <clears throat> me. Then the Sears didn't. That's kind of weird. I'm so I'm I'm gonna go. I'm torn between Reapers and uh, Warp Spiders. Warp Spiders would not get Fleet of Foot, but they would get uh, the Teleport. Um, I think I'm going to go... I'll go... I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. Uh. Little warp spiders. Um, because I know they're gonna have to teleport, even if they don't have blade foot. Because I mean, they don't have it blade foot in a standard game because they have like heavier armor. But again, they do get the teleport. So why are they there? Alright, we've got squad members, the Exarch. Okay. We've got three. And the Exarch, what does the Exarch do? Improves damage for all units. Have as much stuff as we can. Was it 125? That's not bad. Throw hairwire bombs. That's not particularly needed, but hey. Once we have this, we can grab them. Or what the limit is for commanders. Grab that. Oh, this shows resource level. So strategic point gives you 25. Critical location gives 75. Relic gives uh, that. So you can grab like two of these. Enemy captured a relic. So you grab two of these. And then one of you. So wait, 75. Right, they're going over there to capture that. That's while they're capping it, we can get a few hits in. And then we pop out before they can so much as touch us. So that's, that. okay, so we get three of our Exarchs. We grab this, we can grab our three squad members, and then we can start trying to run around them. Running around them. Alright, so let's watch. Does this go down? Yes! So we lose out on that bonus once they cap it. Okay. Alright. Alright. Let's go after them. I. They're not engaging us. Good. They're confused or something? Okay. So this was another slaughter. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, it was a bad teleport apparently because they swapped the directions. And there we go. Down they go. They're gone. Okay, I want one more. I want to try out the Reapers. I'm not particularly interested in Banshees. I'm not sure what they 
I mean, I guess they have like the scream ability, but I feel like th their gameplay would play very similar to the Seer Council. And the Far Seer, I mean, I've already played as the Altarch, so it's just going to be a worse version of that. But I want I want to try Reapers, since I can't teleport, but we'll probably have Fleet of Foot. Uh, and then I think, I'll be done, I'll be done, I'll be done. I'm curious. They always go Assault Marines. If this is the same as Last Stand, which the Eldar setup is, um, like you, if you play Last Stand as Eldar, you can play as all those. Uh, they should be able to grab like a Tactical Marine. They should be able to grab Terminators. They should be able to grab uh, their Force Commander. I want to say something else, but I'm not sure. Um, so it's weird. They're always going Assault Marines. Maybe something to do with like AI priorities or whatever. But hmm. it's interesting. This will be our last game for today. Uh, and then I'll say my adios. <laughs> this is this kind of fun. Yeah, I enjoy this. Um, yeah. For who love life, fear the Reaper. Dark Reaper squad. All right, we do not have Fleet of Foot, but we do have, what? The Dark Reaper Exarch, Howling Banshee Exarch, Fire Dragon Exarch, Warp Spider. Huh. So 50, 100, 575, 100. Huh. Okay. This is interesting. <laughs> I'm not particularly interested in fire dragons because they're going to be anti-vehicle uh, or building, which we're obviously not having to deal with. Banshee, also I'm not going for because uh, that's going to be melee damage. And, well, we're kind of hoping to avoid that. <laughs> uh, so it's going to be Reaper, Exarchs, Warp Spider, Exarchs. So they're the same price. Um... I think the Dark Reaper Exarch is a better investment because he'll have a bit longer range. Um, and this guy's going to be like, oh, I have Hairwire Bombs, which is good against enemy vehicles. We're kind of not dealing with any of those. So, like, that's not particularly helpful. <laughs> All right, they captured that relic. shooting them why aren't they closing to melee <laughs> that's a fight they would win uh poor ai all right it'd be convenient if we had fleet of foot but in the meantime let's get out of the negative cover because it's a speed penalty head over there see if we can get some more hits in All right, now they're closing melee. Now we skedaddle. All right, start shooting. Oh, uh, though also one thing the warp the Exarch has uh, is that you can shoot on the move. And since we can't fleet a foot anyway. Shoot him. Don't get in melee, just shoot him. Can they go back too? Why aren't they engaging? I thought you'd win. Saved me a lot of micro. Did I lose a person? Or we always fight? Oh, they're going past. Okay. If you insist. Alright. So, notably, while it is good to 
save up a bit to get the like expensive people, it's reasonably important also to uh, make sure you spend it so that when you you know lose these points, they uh, like don't. Okay, I think we've won here. Ah, cowards. They don't want to sit here and get shot at. Bok, bok, bok. Uh, when you lose points, uh, you don't lose the resources because they've already been spent. So you're not you're not going to lose the Exarch, right? All enemy squads are dead. All right, that'll be all I have for today. Thank you so much for watching. If you enjoyed, please be sure to leave a like, subscribe to the channel, ring the notification bell, all that wonderful stuff. Uh, but yeah, that is all. Bye.